The bald eagle symbolizes freedom for many Americans. KPVI News That Works For You journalist Kate Garner tells us how one bald eagle is gaining its own freedom. Chances are you've heard the old song, fly like an eagle. But there's one bird here at the Teton Raptor Center that proves that's not always the best idea. And this bald eagle just comes blasting through my window. In late January, a bald eagle flew through a window at Reed Moulton's home in Jackson Hole. There was glass strewn about about 15 feet from the window because you know, this was a 20-pound bird that came through. Moulton called Game and Fish, which in turn contacted the Teton Raptor Center. The center's mission is to advance raptor conservation through education, research, and rehabilitation. This was a case of rehabilitation, and Warren was there for the rescue mission. Started flapping its wings and moving its feet around, and glass was flying all over the place. The bird had a leg tag, and the center learned something special about its new resident. So that eagle is 30 going on 31 this spring. It was tagged in 1989, a time when conservation efforts were hoping to bring back the bald eagle population in the United States, which means this guy could be a big deal. His Jackson Hole was kind of a safe place for, for eagles. That is why we have so many really old ones, but it's also possible that they played a really significant role in repopulating their species. Before this eagle could get back to helping his species, he needed some help. When he came in, he had a few things wrong with him. He had a concussion, he had a, um, an abrasion on one eye, he had several lacerations on his wings and feet, and he had a lead level. But after more than a month of rehabilitation, he was ready to be released early Friday morning, and Reed Moulton got to attend. That's great. In Jackson Hole, I'm Cade Garner, KPVI News That Works For You. It's mating season, and the Eagles mate took up a new partner, so he had to be released in an area away from his old nest.